Listen, be Geo Radio guy first, not Geo Nice guy. I know. Okay. Why did he call you? Yeah. You're I've such a well, good friend. I called him a couple times, I guess. I don't yeah, know. You're so nice. I've been well, calling him every break. He said he tried to call you, but you didn't answer. That's what he says. Yeah. And okay. Car yeah. One, of the, one of us is at work today. Yes. So. And that was a door and not a gate. But all, right, all right. Well, go ahead. Tell me. So what do you want to know? There was so much information right there that I just Where is processed. He? He's in St. Pete's. And he's okay? And he's okay. Okay. He, why is he not here? He tells me he's okay. He told he said that he uh, he he said that his phone went dead oh. and he overslept. And, I mean, call him up right now. Yeah, and he said he's freaking out a little bit because he totally overslept and then he just woke up and because he was with he uh, met the uh, Carmen. Call him. He was at his friend's house from the bar. All right, we're fine. We we'll yeah. get to the bottom of this now. He said if you wanted to call him, he, he you could call him. I oh, am. Thank you. Thanks for the permission. Yeah. Yeah. Well, so I he's no- he's physically okay. He sounds a little rattled. I'd be a little rattled too because he's probably getting fired. My phone died and I overslept. That's what we're going yeah. with. He said he just woke up. Yeah, me too. Where? And he was in his hammock. Well, I don't know. No, let's, I, let's get him on that there. I was, we'll figure uh, it I was out. Joking. I'll walk my way through it. <sighs> hey, it's Carmen. Uh, do you have a minute to go on the air? My heart is racing right now. Does he have a minute to go on the air? <laughs> what? That's a just be like, hold on, you're going on the air. Okay. Hello, Michael. Yes, Michael. Where are you? I am at uh, my friend Sid's place in St. Pete. I'm looking at a, a little lake right now. Um, I have my location. I can share it with you if you want. I apologize for today. Uh, I fell asleep outside and missed my alarm. So okay, sorry. hold on. Start from the beginning. Where where okay. were you last night? And give me the whole rundown. So, so I was at the Cordova last night hanging out. With who? Um, uh, it was me, Sydney, and Katie, and they wanted to go out. Who the hell are Sydney and Katie? They're friends. They're just friends. All right. Uh, yeah, so they're just friends. Um, we went out, and then Sydney brought me back to her place, and I didn't want to sleep at in her place. So I was like, all right, well, I'm just going to crash outside pretty much. Uh, and I did, and I just slept through my alarms. I apologize. You chose to sleep outside last night. Yeah, yeah, not like not like outside, outside, but like on her balcony, oh. on her the balcony of her apartment. Because I didn't, you know, and I didn't what want time to sleep. was this? Um, this is probably like one a.m. So you go out at one a.m. on a work night. Well, no, we we were out before. That was when we got back. Was one a.m. It was very irresponsible, and I do I apologize. Yeah, you apologize all you want. This 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 is probably. I think it's probably irreparable at this point. Okay, I'm sorry. Uh-uh, I'm be sorry. I'm okay. It's irresponsible, and it, and it's you. You didn't do any of the prep for the show today. You didn't. You didn't wake up and call us until nine o'clock or eight forty-five, whatever it was. And now you're just like, oh yeah, no, I got out last night and got drunk and hung. No, out. no, no. I, I don't mean. I don't mean to seem like that. I just know. I don't. I know from the last time. I don't want you to worry. So I, I'm. I'm sorry if I feel. If you feel like. Uh, um, not taking it seriously. I do, I do very much take it seriously. I, I, I just, honestly, I don't feel like you take the job seriously. It, this job should be your priority, and it's definitely not. And you got to call your dad, too, because yeah, we had to call your dad because you're missing again. Because now that's what no, I turned I'll, into a I'll babysitter. You're not a babysitter. No, like I said, I'm not. I, I'm, I'm just, I just didn't want you to worry. I don't. That's all. What does that mean? But what I, do you mean you don't want me to worry? I just don't want you to worry because I, I know of, of the last all the stuff that happened the last time. Yeah, I've been worried since 6 o'clock in the morning when Joe had to figure out how to get here and nobody knew where you were and nobody heard from you. And that's that's when the worrying started. Then, then I had to debate whether or not I had to be the one to call your father and tell your father, so now he's been worried. Well, I will, I will call him, and I'm sorry you had to deal with that. Listen, um, I, I got to be honest with you. I'm, I, I don't I got to the point now where I don't believe anything you say anymore. Okay. Yeah, I, I am. I'm telling you the truth. Um, sorry. I just don't understand what goes through your mind that you think that you being out drinking until midnight is cool to do on a work night. Well, I, I wasn't out drinking until midnight. I was just out, um, and I, like I said, I slept through my alarm. Uh, that that's the part that sucks. I just yeah, I don't know. You, you I, can't, just... I don't believe that you slept through your alarm because not to mention the fact that me and I'm sure dozens of listeners have been calling you all morning. Yeah, I, like I said, I, I don't know. How, I don't know why that is what it is, but yeah, I I, I, I miss all of it. Um, I, did anybody have a hard time 
putting this all together? Yeah, or I, I just don't even understand the concept of going out on a work night when you have to be up at four in the morning. Clearly, this job is not your priority anymore. No, that, that's not true at all. That's not true at all. It's just it, sometimes I overextend myself thinking I could do things that I can't. Yeah, I don't, because I, this job is not the priority. No, that's, like I said, that's, that's not true. It, it is very much the priority. It's the priority some, is going out I, and, and being cool guy and hanging out with your friends during the week. That, that's not a, that's not a priority. But like I said, sometimes I just I misinterpret things that I'm capable of, and it bites me in the ass. I, that doesn't make any sense to me. I don't know. Gio said yeah, he I, said his, I, his phone died, and now he's saying that his you didn't slept hear the ringer. Yeah. Yeah. No, no, I never said my phone died. I said it's on like three percent. That is true. Okay, no. you said. Okay, sorry. No, no, it's all right. I just information. Yeah, yeah. I just didn't know what was going on there. Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know. All right. Well, I don't know what to say either. I guess. I don't know. Well, I, I like I said, I apologize. I, I don't. I, I do take this job very seriously. No, it's not I, true. I mean, you could say that as many times as you want, but here we are with you on a second time of a no call, no show within a matter of months of each other. I got, I got a hand. Listen, I know Joe is not your responsibility, but you do have a, have a routine of taking him with you. So now that's you and, out and Joe uh, having to figure out how to get here and him being a half hour late today, which affects the video portion of the show. So it's it's dominoes is what it is. And, and it all came crashing down today. And not to mention, personally, you just made us all worry. Like, you, you, you're making us freak out. We have to do a show. Meanwhile, the guy who we've been with for the last 15 years is not here, and we have no idea what's going on with him. You know what I mean? And Mike, Mike, yeah, Mike I had to that. call your father. Yeah, you know I how get difficult that, that, that is? That's crazy. Yes, yes, I do. It is crazy. And like I said, I, I do apologize. I, I did not mean for this to happen today. Again. Um, yeah, again. Are you in a... You're not wrong. I am not. I'm not. You know, I'm not perfect. I apologize. I am. Uh, no, uh, there's a difference between I, being perfect and there's a difference yeah. between putting effort into something. And this is clearly not your priority anymore. And I think you really need to think about what those priorities are and what you want out of life because I can't let you in that process bring this show down. No, I, I, I agree with you. And uh, I am not, I'm, I'm not trying to argue with you, but I, I don't agree with that this job is not my priority. You're not like here. I said, I, I You're not here. Up. I know. I yeah. know. I so up. how is it not your priority? Up, yeah. You know, you know, you know what? Who's here? And Galvin's here every morning at the same time, twenty minutes early, and and yeah, and I, every morning you guys stumble in just at the right time, just as the thing, not, no effort. Like I said, I'm not trying to argue with you. I know I'm not here. I wish I was some days, um, but I'm not. And today is not great. And I apologize. I didn't mean to make anybody worry. Um. But it is definitely my part. I don't. I never want to lose this. Uh, you guys mean the world to me. Um, all this does. I, like I said, I just I screwed up, and I am very sorry. All right. Well, you'll um, have to deal I'm, with the consequences of it. I don't know what else to tell you. Because now, I, okay. I, yeah. Because I had to call Jason and wake him up and tell him at six o'clock in the morning. Because you're you're an employee that has disappeared. I get it. And and this is uh, you know added to the list of things that have that you've done. So I don't know what else to tell you. So I guess take it up with them and we'll see. Okay. All right, all right. I I mean I I don't know what else. I I have very little sympathy at this point.